So one great memory I could think of in making a connection between faith, virtue, and sports was uh, a few years ago, I was the coach of our, our girls varsity basketball team, and we were uh, in the CIF championship, the county championship, uh, and we're a very small school, even smaller than we are now at the time. We only had 75 students in our high school, uh, but we were playing a big public school in the championship, a uh, school of 2,500 kids or more. and. We were the two seed, they were the one seed. We had played early in the season, they already beat us by about 20 or 25 points. Um, but we gained a lot of momentum in the, in the season. We, we had a lot of unity as a team. And uh, we made it to the championship. We were down by eight going into the fourth quarter and we put together a run. And the fourth quarter was just this dramatic uh, quarter where both teams were just playing with everything they had and uh, just, just getting after it on the court. It was a real battle. It was a lot of lead changes back and forth, back and forth. And we had a moment where we just had uh, uh, one of our players hit two big free throws to put us up by one point. And we called a timeout to uh, strategize for our defensive uh, series to try to make a stop and, and put an end to this game. And there was just a moment, there was, I think there was, yeah, 20 or 30 seconds left on the clock. And I think because as a team, we had already all year been incorporating virtue into our sports team. We had been incorporating the faith. We've been praying a lot as a team, going to mass together. We had been uh, talking a lot about uh, virtue and how to carry ourselves and how to play together as a team. And we uh, had this moment where there was this huge crucifix at the gym we were playing at. And I just, it caught my eye and I was trying to think of something inspiring to tell the team. And because we had been talking about these types of things all year it just came naturally to say to the team, you know, I want everyone to look at the crucifix right now. I want you to look at Jesus on the cross. And I want you to just uh, imitate Jesus in this moment. We have 30 seconds to go. I want you to just pour yourself out for him, for your team, for your school, for your family, um, and leave nothing on this court. Like you just need to pour yourself out completely in love, just like Jesus did on the cross. You could see the fire in the eyes of the girls and they were super excited. And we had this, uh, Great, great moment at the end where we um, we won the game and they, they, they made this defensive stop and, and it was just a, a really special moment in that championship game to be able to make that connection. And, and the students talked about that moment together. It was just a special moment we had that bound us together in our faith and they made the application of this is, this is real. Like Jesus is the embodiment of virtue. Charity is the queen of virtues. And we could look at the cross and see this is what it means to love and talk about how can we love each other on the team. Well, so much so is just being able to pour yourself out for each other and finding that motivation to do so. Ultimately is I want to love my teammates. I want to love my team. And the way I do that is to give everything that I have. And you don't always win in those moments, but to even do that, whether it's a win or loss, is one of uh, the greatest things that we could teach as coaches to our teams. And so um, I'm just so so grateful for the the virtue strength program to be able to um, to be able to crystallize for us to make these connections to help us make these connections as as coaches um, to see that there's so much connectivity to our faith our catholic faith and wanting to strive after virtue and also playing for victory the th the, the three just intertwine so clearly and so um, just grateful to be able to have those connections made